if you were to produce um, a thread conventionally, it'd be a drill, chamfer, tap. But with this tool, you can do it all. So you can remove three pockets. Joining me today is Alistair from Vargas UK, and we're going to be talking about thread milling, a mini masterclass, if you like. So obviously, you've got a large range of Vargas, of all products, but yeah. predominantly thread milling today. Four different, distinctively different tools there. So maybe you can just give us a, a snapshot of each. Yeah, so we've got the uh, MITM, which is our uh, indexable um, and mill thread mill that you see here. Uh, we've got one of our MACTM solid carbide mills. We've got one of our Milli Pros, uh, which is a five times D version, and um, we've got a TMDR. So they all have their own um, strengths. Yeah, just on the TMDR, that's quite, you know, that's quite unique, isn't it? Just tell the audience about that one. Yeah, so the TMDR, you're able to um, not only thread mill, but you can also drill and chamfer with that tool. So someone on a driven tool lathe, perhaps, where you've got limited um, mm -hmm. pockets that are available, um, it may be a great option for them if they're looking to reduce the number of driven tool heads that they need to perhaps purchase. So if you were to produce um, a thread conventionally, it'd be a drill, chamfer, tap. But with this tool, you can do it all. So you can remove three pockets. Sure, and that, that's big. That's big. Even on VMCs now, people are looking to reduce the inventory, have less tools due to carousels and things, certainly with automation present. Um, the Mac, that, that's obviously a product we've seen a lot with on this channel as well, we've, we've done a lot on the Mac uh, tool, but for, for those that haven't seen it, obviously it's five flute, deep core, but tell us a little more. Yeah, so essentially it's um, it's an improved uh, version of what we're already, already offering. Um, it's got a larger core diameter. It's got an extra flute. It can feed incredibly quickly. It can be, uh, in some instances, instances, a lot quicker than tapping. Um, it's got an improved edge prep, the coating is unique to this and the substrate is unique to this product as well. So a very, very robust, mm. versatile and fast thread mill. Mm -hmm. And on the larger side, I presume that's down to economy, right? You know, in indexable systems. Yeah, so there's the uh, MITM that you see there. Um, we offer that in a multiple um, flute setup. Uh, you can get shell mill versions of that. Uh, and it's, it's, it's a great product, really. We offer many, many different uh, versions of indexable thread mills. Mm -hmm. and, and the other one, didn't get the name, the, the other small one, where, where, where does that fit? Because obviously you, you, those three cover pretty much all applications. So what, what, what's the other one for? Yeah, so the Milli Pro, um, this, is a, this is a great um, offering where we are fighting against push off. So if you're trying to produce those longer threads and you need to get deep into those holes, the three flutes, uh, the three cutting edges on this um, alleviate some of the the forces that you'll see while producing the thread. So it gives much more stability, better thread control. Um, and obviously you can get right down to five times D with this product. So great offering. Sure. And the number one reason people like tapping, mm -hmm. this is my opinion, uh, number one reason people like tapping ahead of thread milling, really it's down to the application, it's down to the program, it's down to the software. Mm -hmm. But I know using your genius software, you've got a solution for that as well. You're able to use it like a conversational control pick the thread form that you're trying to produce, maybe an M10 by 1.5, pick the uh, thread depth, the type of material, and then the app will recommend um, some tools from our VOGS range. You're able to then thin that down to perhaps what's more application specific. And from there, we're able to generate a program um, which is able to be produced in a variety of all the common controls. So obviously it's a vast range. How does the stocking look and also how's the technical support at Vargas? Yeah, so they're fully stocked in the UK, supported by technical engineers who are all time served. Um, so any sort of questions, technical or otherwise, please get in contact. Great. And how do they do so? Vargas.com.co.uk, whatever. Yeah, uh, Vargas UK Limited um, or reach out to us on LinkedIn and other methods. Brilliant. Ali, thank you so much for coming in. So there we have it, a large range of thread mills, as you'd probably expect from Vargas, but please do take a look. And if you want to give them a try, why not get in touch?